Hello, this is Mr. Srinivasan who is having more than 30 years experiences in the construction industries. Trying to give you a small presentation on contrast between one way and two way slab. The left hand direction shows the one way slab. The right hand direction shows the AutoCAD drawing of the two way slab. Concreting slab. In reinforced concrete construction, the slab is extensively used structural element forming floors and roofs. A concreting slab is a plain element having the depth and much smaller than its span and width. It may be supported by reinforced concrete beam or by masonry walls or directly by columns. Difference between one way and two way slab are as follows. This is an image of how the slab has been working around. What is one way slab? Slab supported only on two opposite sides by rigid supports carry the load by flexure in the direction perpendicular to the support. The plane surface, surface of a predominantly uniformly loaded slab deforms into a cylindrical surface in which curvature and hence bending moment develops only in one direction. Such slab is called as a one-way slab. Deformation of a one-way slab image has been shown originally. What is two-way slab? The rectangular slab supported on two adjacent or three or four edges and with their ratio of longer to shorter span less than the two which carry the load by fracture in two perpendicular direction are called as a two-way slabs. Deformation of the two-way slabs will be look like this. It will be totally curved. How to calculate a one-way or two-way slab? If length divided by breadth ratio is greater than or equal to two, then it is considered as a one-way slab. Longer span divided by shorter span, that is L length divided by breadth is greater or less than 2. If LB ratio is less than 2, then it is considered as a two-way slab. Longer span divided by shorter span, that is a length divided by breadth is less than 2. Difference between one-way slab and two-way slabs are as follows. Low transfer methodology in one and two way slabs. This image uh, diagram shows how the load transferred in one way and two way slabs. In one way slab it is in one direction. In two way slabs might be a two way or a four way directions. Please kindly watch these images which will give you a rough idea of about it. Parameters of the one way slab and the parameters of the two way slab. If length divided by breadth is radio is greater than or equal to 2, then it is considered as a one-way slab. If length divided by breadth ratio is less than 2, then it is considered as a two-way slab. In one-way slab, the main reinforcement is provided in a short span and distribution in a long span. In two-way slab, the main reinforcement is provided in both the direction. In one-way slab, the crank is provided in two directions, whereas in two-way slab, it is in four directions. The one-way slab is supported by a beam or two opposite sides, whereas in two-way slab, it is supported by the beam on all four sides. Only in one-way slab, the load is carried in one direction, perpendicular to the supporting beam. The load is car carried out in both the directions in which two-way slab. The deflected shape of the one-way slab is cylindrical, whereas the deflected shape of the two-way slab is a dish or a saucer-like shape. Particular examples of one-way slab. Whereas two-way slabs are used in the constructive floors of the multi storied building. While designing one-way slab, we provide less steel, hence the depth of the slab is increases. As a result, the thickness of the one-way slab is more. In two-way slab, we provide more steel, hence the depth of the slab decreases. 
resulting the thickness of the two way slab is been thinner compared to the one way slab the one way slab is economical up to span of 3 to 6 meters the two way slab is economical for the panel size of 6 meter by 6 meter in one way slab quantities of the steel is less whereas in two way slab it is more in one way slab bending is the only one direction that is in the shorter span bending in the both the direction in the two way slab in practice the choice of the one way slab and two way slab for a particular structure will largely depend upon the economy buildability loading conditions and length of the span reinforcement details of one way slab this is the reinforcement detail of the one way slab whereas the main bar facing in the shorter direction distribution bar showing in the longer direction this is an autocad image which shows how the one way slab has been designed this is an another image which will clearly explain you how the one way slabs looks like set image of one way slab the image of the one way slab is look like this if length divided by breadth that is a 10 by 4 is equal to 2.5 less than 2 uh, sorry greater than 2 from the above drawing it is clear that length and the length divided by breadth is greater than 2 hence it is a one way slab so the main bar or a cranked bar are provided in a shorter span and distribution are provided in the longer span please see the images which will give a clear idea how this reinforcement has been placed details of and images of two way slab reinforcement details of two way slab is as follows length divided by breadth that is 6 meter by 6 meter slab is equal to 1 that is less than 2 from the shown drawing it is clear that length and breadth is ratio is less than 2 hence it is a two way slab that is why main bars are cranked bars are provided as a longer span as well as a shorter span also see the images it will give you it is a 6 by 6 so it is 1 so it is greater less than 2 so the main bar has been in the both the directions this is the image of a two way slab and this is an autocad image of a two way slab thank you for watching this presentation kindly subscribe like and share which will motivate me for further good presentations in case any queries do not hesitate to write to me the response shall be at the earliest images courtesy is google images contact me on civil conclave at the rate of gmail.com or at my telegram group or srini telegram group the link is as follows thank you for watching this presentation kindly subscribe please thank you once again